Let's pray again for a moment. Lord, we know the words of the gospel, but I don't think we allow them to echo in our hearts sufficiently. Lord, we ask you by your Holy Spirit to reveal your heart to our hearts. And help us to respond to that by yielding absolutely everything to you. Lord, I'm going to be speaking now, but as always, if it's no more than my thoughts and ideas, it's of no benefit whatsoever. So, Lord, we ask that once again you would cleanse and use this vessel and speak through me to each one of us. And we ask you to take, uh, enable us to take what we hear from you into our hearts and rejoice to put it into practice. That everything would be for your glory, we ask it with thanksgiving. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Actually, I had been fully expecting to share with you more of what I was blessed by at the conference, pastor's conference that I went to, but the Lord had a different idea. Uh, and we need to be aware that God is always talking to us. The problem is that we aren't always listening. Uh, um, but just because God has said something new to you doesn't mean that the last thing that he said to you is no longer valid. God's word has marvelous unity. Just read the Old Testament, the New Testament, and you'll go jumping around and, man, it is marvelously united. Uh, but this past Wednesday morning, God really got my attention. Titus 2, 11 to 14. これちょっと長いから日本語で高橋兄弟に読んでもらいたいと思いますが、あの、私は英語で読みます。
This is a little long, so I've asked uh, Brother Takashi to read it in Japanese, and then I'll read it in English. Tetosu eno tegami nisho no juichi kara juyon setsu. The letter to Titus, uh, chapter 2, verses 11 to 14. お願いします。実に全ての人に救いをもたらす神の恵みが現れてのです。大いなる神である私たちの救い主であるイエスキリストの栄光が現れを待ち望むように教えています。キリストは私たちを全ての方法から贖い出し、良い技に熱心な選びの神をご自分のものとして清めるため私たちのために for the grace of God that brings salvation has appeared to all men. It teaches us to say no to ungodliness and worldly passions and to live self-controlled, upright, and godly lives in this present age. While we wait for the blessed hope, the glorious appearing of our great God and Savior, Jesus Christ, who gave himself for us to redeem us from all wickedness and to purify for himself a people that are his very own, uh, eager to do what is good. 正直私がテトス書からメッセージをするのがめったにないんです。Actually, I very rarely speak from Titus. Uh,皆さんの中でそのテトスというのがその新約聖書の歌の一言葉。<laughs> now, some of you might know Titus simply as one of the words in the uh, song that we sing from the uh, book names of the New Testament. But now we talk about God's grace a lot, but I think we very rarely think about it in the terms that this passage just talked about. Um, but just because we rarely think about it this way doesn't mean that this contradicts uh, where it talks about grace in other places in the Bible. Now, the Bible is amazingly unified, but it is also very deep. That's why we need to keep reading it. まあ、時々私は言うんですね。あの、聖書を何回通読してるか、私でも数をわからない、多くて。けど、それに関わらず、朝のデボーションの時に、ピーンそう書いてたのと驚く時もあります。Now, as I've talked about before, I've read the Bible through more times than I'm, I'm sure of. I have no idea how many times I've read through the Bible, but it's a lot. Uh, but even so, when I'm reading the Bible, my morning devotion, sometimes I'll get a bing. Hey, where'd that come from? Did it really say this all along? That um, megumi. Now, grace is unmerited favor. 
神様が私たちのためにな,なしてくださる良いことのいずれも私たちはそれを与えすべきでないよ。We don't deserve any of the good stuff that God does for us. あの赤ちゃんがそのお母さんの愛情を稼いで得るわけではないんですね。Now, a baby does not earn its mother's love. 逆にお母さんをかなり痛ませて誕生するんですね。Now, quite the opposite. It gives its mother a lot of pain in the process of appearing in the earth. にかかわらずお母さんが無条件な愛を注いでくださいます。But in spite of that, the mother gives unconditional love to their baby. 問題は私たちが神の恵みを当たり前にしてしまいがちです。But the big problem is that we tend to take God's grace for granted. もちろんこんなにしてくださると思ってしまう。We think, well, of course he's doing these things for me. 恵みを勘違って。もう堕落の許可として受け止めてしまう場合もあります。Sometimes we mistake grace for license. 何でもしてもいい。罰が来ないと誤解してしまう。We think it's okay to do anything, nothing will happen. 休みを貸しても、はい、あの、はい。許してくださいとそれで OK と思ってしまう。We think we can do anything, commit any sin, and oh, sorry about that, you know. 真の悔い改めだったらもちろん許されます。が、真の悔い改めは条件ですね。With genuine repentance, there is, of course, forgiveness. But it needs to be genuine repentance. Hmm. 神様がすぐ許してくれる,くれるから、この罪を犯してもいいね、と。前もって計画的な罪。してしまうね。<laughs> we think, ah,、oh, no, if I commit this sin,、uh, God will forgive me, so we go ahead and commit the sin. That's planning for sin. あの殺人いやどんな段階があるでしょう事故で人が亡くなったら、まあ、責任があるが比較的に軽い、まあ、計画的にうんどういうふうにしようか、はい、この毒をこういうふうに食べさせたらということだったらひどい刑死刑の可能性までありますね。There's all kinds of levels legally speaking to killing somebody.If it's strictly an accident, then you have responsibility.But it's fairly light. But if you had planned on it, let's see if I get this poison to them in this way, and that sentence is going to be very severe, and it could well be death for you. Megumi wa kyoka to chiga on this name. Grace is not permission. 私たちが罪浴びるために神様は私たちを救うわけでないんですね。God does not save us 
to wallow in sin. 私たちは神様の恵みを理解するほど罪からどんどん解放されるんですよ。自由になります。The more we understand grace, the better we understand it, the freer we are from sin.、Um, これがあの、uh, 宗教革命の随分前だったんですけど、アウ,アウグスチヌスという人がいて、uh, 彼が神を愛し、好き勝手にしなさい。Now, Augustine was well before the Protestant Reformation, but he said something rather shocking. He said, Love God and do as you please. 実は本当に神様を愛するなら神様を喜ばすことしかしません。Actually, if you really love God, you will only do things that please Him. 自分の愛を吟味するための発言でしたね。That was a statement to cause us to examine our own level of love. の愛その恵みを本当に理解しないと悪魔にとらわれてしまう危険が大きいんですよ。If we fail to understand God's love, His grace, then it's very easy to be trapped by the enemy. ペテロの第二の手紙。一章の九節。Second Peter 1, 9. ペテロの第二の手紙。一章の九節。Second、uh, Peter 1, 9. これらを、uh, 備えていないものは、uh, uh, 禁止眼であり、盲目であって、自分の以前の罪が清められたことを忘れてしまったのです。But if anyone does not have them, he is nearsighted and blind, and has forgotten that he has been cleansed from his past sins. 実はごあ五節から読むとこれは何を指しているかと分かりますけどね。Actually, if you read from verse 5, you'll find the things that this is referring to. こんなことをないものは、盲目と言ってもいいんですね。気づいていない。Actually,、uh, reading from verse 5, you understand what this is talking about. But it said, if you don't have these good qualities, you're blind. 神様の愛、その恵み、見えてません。You can't see God's love and grace. 実はこの一節が、私の解放、にもなりました。Actually, this verse resulted in my deliverance. 私はある罪にはまってました。I was stuck in a particular sin. あ、はあ、またやっちゃったと思いながら、やったことをまた思い巡らして、またやっちゃった。I would think, oh, I did it again. And thinking about how I did it, I'd do it again. ゆるされてる、清められてることを
忘れてました。I had forgotten that I was forgiven, that I was cleansed. 本当に許されてると信じないなら、また犯してしまう確率がぐんと上がるんですよ。If you don't really understand that you have been forgiven, the probability of committing that same sin again is much higher. When we understand, when we grasp all that God did for us in Christ, His grace toward us, we will be active in our obedience. Namaketa Christian ga Kami sama no megumi wakatte nai. A lazy Christian does not understand God's grace. Kami sama no megumi o wakatte ru to tsune ni shuyo. Do shite hoshi no? Nani o katatte hoshi no? どんな行動をしてほしいのですかと常に尋ねてるんです。Someone who understands God's grace is constantly saying, God, what do you want me to do? What would you like me to say? How would you like me to act? それはこの箇所、最初読んだ箇所の意味ですね。That's what that first passage from Titus is talking about. 実は神様の恵みに対して一番有名な箇所もこれに触れるんですよ。Actually, the most famous passage on grace also deals with this. エペソビトゥニテガミ、ニシオの Ephesians 2, 8 to 10. Ephesians 2, 8 to 10. あなた方は恵みのゆえに信仰によって救われたのです。それは自分自身から出たことではなく、神からの賜物です。行いによるのではありません。誰も誇ることのないためです。私たちは神の作品であって、良い行いをするためにキリストイエスにあって作られたのです。神は私たちをが良い行いに歩むために、その良い行いをもあらかじめ備えてくださったのです。For it is by grace you have been saved through faith. And this not from yourselves, it is the gift of God, not by works, so that no one can boast. For we are God's workmanship, created in Christ Jesus to do good works, which God prepared in advance for us to do. 実は私たちは急節で止まる傾向が強いんですよ。Actually, we have a strong tendency to stop. With verse 9. Hi. We tend to stop at verse 9 and say, Oh, by grace I'm saved through faith. That's all. いや実説を読むとそれがそのテトス書のところと 100% 一致してますね。But verse 10 agrees perfectly with 
the passage we read from Titus. Actually, I could go on and on and on and on and on about this. <laughs> Sister Atsumi knows the truth of that statement, so she's kind of laughing. <laughs>、um, Uh, we need to grasp the magnitude of God's grace toward us. That's the same word that's used in talking about earthquakes. 私たちにはマグニチュード10の心身必要としてますね。自身でなって心身。We need a magnitude 10 heartquake, not an earthquake, a heartquake. 私たちは神様の恵みの偉大さを悟り。それに応答しましょう。May we grasp the greatness of God's grace toward us and respond to that. それは感謝と従順。神様の栄光のために。That will be in gratitude and obedience. For God's glory. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we tend to take your grace lightly. Lord, help forgive such foolish ones as we are. Lord, by your Holy Spirit, reveal your grace to us. That we may respond to it. あなたのご栄光のために感謝して、主イエスキリストの皆によってお願いいたします。For your glory, we ask it with thanksgiving in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen.